What's up guys, Parker here with another Power BI 3 minute tip. In today's video, I wanna show you a quick trick on how to show your dates in a different format. So since I'm in the US, my dates show as month, day, year, but a lot of other countries don't show that way. So in case you're working for a client in a different country or maybe you're putting together a model for your friend who's in a different country, I'm gonna show you some steps to show it in a different date format. So let's go ahead and start by right clicking on this column and duplicating it. And I wanna show this new column as a date that would display in the UK, since the UK has day, month, year format. So all you have to do is right click and go to change type and using locale. And it's gonna give you the options of the different data types you want. We actually want to select text because that's actually going to allow us to show in a different format. And we're gonna set our locale in our example to English United Kingdom. And once we do that and click OK, we now see the date in the day, month, year format. So there's only one downside to this. As you can see, it is in text format and it's not a date um, type anymore. And dates, if you change this back to a date, it will show up as our US date because that is using the setting of Power BI, I think, in which you downloaded it. So since I downloaded the English version, the English American version, I believe it's always going to show this US looking date. So, but we are able to manipulate the text representation of that date to show uh, basically using different locales. So I'm gonna go ahead and close and apply. And we can uh, kind of get around this issue in some visuals. I wanna show you how sometimes it's not quite as important to have a date and you can use text. So the first thing I want you to note is that text isn't going to give you um, the hierarchy by default. So if I drag my date field in here, this date US, you see how I have the date hierarchy. You're not gonna get that with text when you drag this through. Um, you're actually just going to have the text field itself. And actually just real quick, I wanna add an index column because I wanna add some numerical data. So I'm gonna add an index column and then I'm going to close and apply. So I basically wanna show you how you can make your visuals act more like they were using dates. So I'm gonna go ahead and delete this and I'm gonna bring in a line chart. Throw it in the middle. And we are going to select our copy date. This is our UK date now. And we're gonna throw an index in the values. And we can see that it's sorting a little bit weird. If we were to look, this is December 30th, 2018, December 15th, 2018, so it's kind of backwards right now. And if we sorted ascending, we see 1, 1, 150, 130. So that's actually looking pretty good. So you're gonna to have to pay attention to the sort order when you're using text, because sometimes it might be a little bit different than you expect, but this is looking pretty good. So that's pretty much it. I wanted to show you how you can display dates in a different format. So if you like this video, make sure you hit the subscribe button and I'll see you in the next Power BI 3 Minutes.